Welcome back to the Tech Couch and my video on strike 10 pin bowling. Specifically, we're gonna be looking at the splits mini game in this one. And we've been doing a whole series on the strike 10 pin bowling game. It's a great game for the Apple TV. And we've covered, you know, we're covering all the mini games. So if you wanna see any of those or the overview video, check that out in the description below. I'll drop links to any of the other videos. Um, but this one, we're going to look at this splits minigame. It's 30 frames of splits. Um, clear all of them to be a true professional. And these are hard. I'm certainly not a professional. I'm not good at real bowling. I'm not very good at this game. But if you are, especially if you played this minigame, I'd love to hear how you did some of these. These are hard. I have a lot of trouble. I'm going to give you my... Uh, my ideas and thoughts and suggestions, but uh, I'd love to hear from those experts because these ones, some of these are really tough. And um, I think working on splits is one of those things that really improves your game because when those come up, you usually can't do much. You just get stuck. You gotta try to go for one pin or set of pins or the other that are split from it. Um, but if you can do this, you can hit any shot. So let's dive into the game with that. Of course, we're just going to start with the um, 30 games of splits. So basically, we've got 10 frames here, um, and we got five balls, and we got to try to hit all the different all the different split scenarios uh, with those five balls. And so let's just like dive right into it. Here's the first one. I think I can get this one with a good curve. So nailed it. And there's gonna be 10 different scenarios here, and I gotta to try to get them all. So I'm just gonna run through these. Uh, these are hard. I think, you know, for some of these, like these easier ones that we start with, you could start with a curve that just goes in the path of both balls and hits them both. Uh, you know, for this one, I haven't gotten it yet, but I'm basically starting from the outside, curving in towards the two balls. So that's, I guess, my, my technique for that one. Now we're getting a bit harder with the three balls, but I'm gonna come in on the same way. I'm gonna come in on an angle and see if I can, oh, that was no good. See if I can curve it in into the trajectory of the three different balls and hit them all. It was close, didn't get it on that one. Um, there you go. So kind of bounced off the first balls in the right spot. This one's looking a bit harder for me, but I'm gonna to try to Maybe get it right down the middle and hit them both if I get it hard enough. I don't I don't know. This is where it definitely gets hard for me. That was lucky. I so I was in the right path for both and that was good. I'll take that. This here, um I don't know. I feel like maybe come in on an angle, come in and curving in this way. You know what? Got it right in the middle, hit it on, and that was good, but I could see that being a tough one. Now for these kinds here, I, I don't know, this is like getting into real split territory. So when you when you lose the first time, you get a chance to get five more balls. It looks like it doesn't cost anything. I'll do it and you could do that twice. So maybe I'll come in hard on the side here, try to hit that front pin, the six pin. So up here you see, it shows you which pins there are. So I'm gonna try to hit the six pin, uh, maybe come in here, hit the six pin on its side, send it that way, and then nail the 10 pin with the ball. Let's see if I can do that. Oh, almost. Try it again. A little closer to the six pin. Oh, that was a curve. So here's an example probably where you really want to use these arrows. Like that probably helps you. I didn't look at where the first shot was. But, you know, if it was too far, maybe you want to come in a little bit. That's what I'm going to do. This is a hard one for me. So now I'm going to go out a little bit further. See if that does it on a very strange shot, almost out a tiny bit further, I guess. Oh, that curved, so that wasn't good. Okay, game over. So, I mean, this is this is where I got stumped. A little five four, why not? Love to nail this one if I could. So you see I'm trying to get that ball to kind of just pop out there. Almost had it on that one, but not quite. 
Same thing. I mean, I just, I guess I'm not going to get this one. Almost. So, I mean, if anyone is an expert and knows how to solve this one, I'd love to see it. I guess it's something along what I'm doing. Maybe there's a different type of shot where you come along this end and curve it in, or I, I don't know. I don't know. I'd love to just, I'd love to see an expert solve this one. I'm stumped, game over. So, last chance. I'm not gonna take it. I can't, I, like, okay, fine. So, thanks for joining me again on the Tech Couch for my 10-pin bowling. Check out the other videos in the series if you're interested. And if you have some help on how to solve this splits game, which might very well be the hardest or the second hardest minigame, let us know. Thanks for joining us. Take it easy.